Hey angels, what's up? It's your girl Alicia and I'm coming to you today with another video. In this video today, as you can see by the title, I'm going to be telling you guys how to start your own sunglass business. And this video has been highly, 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 highly requested. And um, I'm going to help you guys out today. And it's not going to just be one video. I'm actually going to turn this into a series because there's a whole lot of information that goes into it and i don't want any of it to be rushed i want you guys to understand how it is that you can start your own online business and all of the steps that's necessary that you have to take so within this series there's actually going to be more information as far as branding marketing how to package and ship um i'm going to be giving you guys some more information as far as registering your business and how to get everything solidified and certified I'm also going to be doing a separate video on how to start your own sunglass line. Having your own sunglass business and having your own sunglass line is two different things, guys. So I'm going to be telling you guys the difference between that. And I'm going to be digging deeper into finding a wholesale vendor. So in this video today, we're going to be talking about how to start your own sunglass business. And I'm going to be breaking it down step by step for you guys. So make sure you guys get yourself a notebook and a pen and you're ready to learn. This is a very informative video. So if you don't like informative videos and you don't like to learn, then this video is not for you. If you are new to my channel, welcome to my channel. My name is Alicia. Here on my channel, I call my subscribers my angels. So please make sure you hit that subscribe button and come and join the family. Become one of my angels. Um, I have a lot of information to teach you guys and just share with you guys. So I would love to have you come over here and join us. And without further ado, let's just dive right into this video. Okay, Angel, so first and foremost, you might be asking yourself, why should I start a sunglass business? And I'm going to tell you guys, I feel as though starting a sunglass business is a very great idea if you're looking to be like an entrepreneur and coming out into the business. Because with a sunglass business, you are definitely going to get a very easy return on your investment. They call that ROI. Um, if you guys are new to the business world, then you wouldn't know what a ROI is. A ROI is a return on your investment. That means what it is that you put out into the business, it's very easy for you to get it back and multiply it. Starting a sunglass business is also a very easy business to start up. And it also has a very low startup cost. So it's not gonna cost you guys a lot of coins to get your business off the ground. And I'm going to teach you guys today. Also, another reason why you should start a sunglass business is based off of statistics. Sunglasses generated $3.6 billion in revenue in 2016 alone, and it has been multiplying up until today. The US online eyewear business is going to jump up so high and triple by 2025. So you guys definitely want to get on this money train and it's easy money to make and everybody wears glasses. Everybody loves glasses. So these are the reasons why you will want to start an online sunglass business. So the first thing it is that you would want to do before starting your business is you want to research guys. Number one is research because there's a lot of information out on the internet, on Google. You can just find information on YouTube and stuff like that. Although there's like no information as far as starting your online sunglass business. So I'm going to fill this niche for you guys. But you want to do some research because you want to understand what it is that you're selling. You want to know if you're selling prescription glasses. Is your, Are you just selling like fashionable items? Um, what type of sunglasses you want to sell? You want to know your target market as far as are you selling to men? Are you selling to women? Are you selling to kids? Like what kind of eyewear will you be selling? Make sure you do your research. Also by doing your research guys, you're also going to be able to find out a lot of things that you need to know and expect while being in business because you're not always going to have somebody to teach you like I'm here to teach you guys today you're not always going to have somebody here to teach you so sometimes you have to be really productive and teach yourself especially as an entrepreneur the next thing you want to do is you want to choose your business name and make sure that your business name is not long make sure that it's easy to remember 
and make sure that it's it's unique you want a unique name that's perfect for you that represents your business your brand whatever it is that you're going for make sure it's very unique guys and this is the business name that you are going to choose and rock with um sometimes you need a little help choosing your business name so ask friends and family narrow it down to like two or your top two or three and then come up with your final business name and that is what you're going to roll with so once you have your business name guys it's time to register your business now when you're registering your business this usually costs about 25 to 50 dollars depending on the state that you live in it varies and also with registering your business this is where all the legal stuff comes in at so you want to make sure you um check online and they have a database for every state um a business database for every state and you can check and see if your business name is available you want to make sure that name is available before you go ahead with it so that you can make sure nobody else has your name so check the database it's free to check type in your name that you're thinking about using and it'll tell you if it's available you also need to register your business you want to decide if you want your business to be sole proprietorship a LLC and things of that sort you need to register with the state and make sure you get a seller's permit and you need a, a EIN number and you also need your tax ID number and just to let you guys know you can get your seller's permit for free stay tuned because I'm gonna go into more details in a separate video within this series on all of the legal things that you need as far as registering your business so the next thing you want to do guys is you want to choose your website platform there's so many different website platforms you could choose from you can choose from shopify um there's big cartel there's weebly there's wordpress there's wix um there's squarespace there's so many different website platforms that you can try and test out i suggest that you go online once again research and choose which website platform benefits you the most um online they actually break them down into pros and cons and they also break them down into pricing too so if you're looking for more of an affordable option they have those there and if money is not an option to you then they have those options there as well so once you actually choose your website platform it is going to be very very important for you to buy your domain name um your domain name is a name that's catered specifically to you like for my business i have shop 919 frames.com you can get dot com um it doesn't have to be dot com you can get other things but you don't want it to have like the website's platform name or something at the end like shop 919 frames dot shopify dot like you don't want any of that you just want it to be straight up your name so you can buy your domain name online usually they offer it through your website platform um so like if you go through shopify they usually have like a feature on there where you can buy purchase your domain name or you can actually go to godaddy.com and you can purchase a domain name it usually range between 399 to like 999 a year so it's very affordable but it's worth the money because people need to very easily get to your site like aliciamotley.com like it's that simple they don't need all the extras because nobody will ever shop your site the next thing it is that you guys what want to do is you want to design your website um, if you're not familiar with designing websites, it's so many people out there that design websites. Um, actually, one of my YouTube sisters, Unique Terche, she does a lot of um, media stuff like that. Um, my sister, Miss Most of Balls, here on YouTube as well, she does a lot of media things. So check them out as well. Not sure how much they do as far as websites, but check them out for all your media resources and stuff like that. They're very good with this whole YouTube thing and business very 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 beautiful business minded women um, so make sure you guys check them out also you can go to Fiverr it is an app that you can get on your phone they have a website as well and it's people just like me and you that offer our services that we things that you're just really good at and you can offer your services and get paid for so it's people on there that's waiting for you then that wouldn't mind building a website for you so that's definitely an option but you guys need a website okay guys so the next thing you will want to do is you want to find your wholesale vendor and 
This can be a very, very difficult and tedious task. It's very stressful because you have to make sure you test out these vendors. You can't just find one vendor and go with them. No, you can't do that. Like you have to test out each and every vendor. You have to know if they are a US based vendor or are they based in China? Um, it's a lot of things to take into account when you're looking for a wholesaler and I'm going to do that in a whole separate video But understand that you guys need a reliable wholesale vendor This is going to be like the most important thing to your business Because people are depending on you to have these sunglasses on hand And they're also depending on you to get them to them in a timely manner So you have to make sure you have a good wholesaler not only that, your wholesaler is actually going to be the ones providing your sunglasses. So you want to make sure everything is top quality. Um, it's not sunglasses that's breaking easily or scratched up. You want to make sure everything is 100% A1 so that your business keeps a very good reputation. Okay, and just to let you guys know, I have a list of wholesale vendors on my website. You guys can find it. I will make sure I leave the link down below. There is a list on there that I have tested out myself personally. And all of these vendors are US based. I'm going to pull it up here on my cell phone so you guys can know. On the website, it will say looking for high quality, trustworthy, and high fashion vendors for your sunglass business. This list is for you. Enjoy our directory of US vendors with exact names and exact websites to start purchasing your products wholesale and start in your business today. Our vendors are tested and certified with several years of expertise in the wholesale industry to ensure your products are in great condition, shipped in a timely manner, and maintain a professional work relationship between business owner and vendor. We have also added a bonus at no additional charge. Included in our directory is a list of private labeling vendors that can help anyone interested in customized eyewear. Our vendors will help you with designs, concepts, and final production. So with this list guys, once you pay for it, you'll be able to download it straight to your laptop or your phone and it's right on the website. Again, I will leave that link down below. If you guys are ready to go and you want a trusted source where you can get your vendors from, and you don't have to do all the testing and waste all the money that's involved in finding different vendors and buying different sunglasses and everything on your own. You just wanna get right to the source. This is a very good directory and it's worth the money. So make sure you guys check down below and check it out for wholesale vendors.